Little Rafidi Niaina was born in St. Augustine by the light of a solar lamp. Her parents, Natasha and Germain, are proud users of a solar system thanks to the Solar Village Project, launched by the Swiss Malagasy NGO ADES and the German GTZ. Solar Village, the users pay monthly electricity fees. St. Augustine, on the coast 25 kilometers south of Tuliar, offers ideal conditions for the rural electrification project. I'm I'm going to go to the telephone and I'm going to go to the radio. 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 Astina, the chief engineer at ADES, has a lot of experience installing solar systems. He trained Sulu and Ndesi, two young men from the village, to become technicians. And I'm so Sulu and Pulu from solar to tomorrow. It pays to have solar electricity. The health risk cannot be neglected. Since the health center has been equipped with electric lighting, the number of women coming to the maternity to deliver has almost doubled. The bright lights give them confidence. The school has also been equipped with a solar system. The villagers can now hold meetings in the evenings and a computer course is being offered. The teachers can do additional tutoring to help pupils prepare for exams. <laughs> Avec ce projet, nous avons démontré que c'est possible de faire de l'électrification rurale. Et maintenant, mon rêve, mon désir le plus ardent, c'est de pouvoir électrifier toute la côte ouest.